Hello everyone. Welcome back to Scratch Programming. Children, in today's class we will learn how to create shapes using pen block. Let's start. So this is our Scratch window. So children, uh, you can see here I am using Scratch 3. Okay, so in Scratch 3 children, uh, we will never get pen block here. So every time whenever we create a new program, we need to attach it with the help of extension. So here add extension you can see at the bottom click here and see pen block is here now you just need to click here and all the options that we can see in the pen block all are available now so i have already explained all the blocks earlier so first let me choose one sprite here so i am choosing go and let me delete the sprite okay so this is our sprite children now let me take erase all first and here first we'll use when flag is clicked because uh, whenever we want to start our program we need to use it so when flag is clicked now from the motion block move 10 steps and turn 15 degree here we are trying to create a circle okay so whenever we want to create a circle children what we want we want that first it will move and then turn every time it will turn and then only it will move so same steps we want to repeat every time so we will use control block repeat here okay i'm increasing the number of repeat let's say 25 okay so what will happen here here every time it will turn and move for 20 times now we want okay let me show you here see now you can see it's circular motion now what i want children i want here that every time whenever it will move let me increase the number of steps whenever it will move it will create something means it will draw something on the stage so whenever we want that our sprite will draw something always use pen down and after pen down we need to choose pen size if you will not choose pen, pen size it will initially it will be one only okay so i am choosing pen size here and let me choose pen color and set pen color okay it's fine now now see see it is creating a circle now children at any point of time you want that your sprite will move but it will create a colorful circle so what you want these steps will be the same but after every repetition we want to change its color so use change pen color inside the repeat block now see see now we can see color colorful circle uh, why because we can, we have attached change pen, pen color by 10 after every repetition okay so this is how we can create circle children now now we'll try to create square so here if we want to create a square children so what we want initially we want that first it will set its direction and after setting its direction it will move for few steps let's say 100 steps and every time it will turn 90 degree why 90 degree i told you uh, perpendicular we want in square if you know every each and every line is perpendicular to the other line so perpendicular means each and every line has 90 degree of angle so every time it will move steps and turn 90 degree now we want to repeat the same thing four times right because in square we can have four edges so here let me attach here erase all and okay let's try ha huh, we can see here we can see uh, it has create uh, now uh, one square is there now same way if you want a colorful square then 
you need to use change pen color by 10 inside the repeat block children. See, see, now you can see it's a colorful square. In the same way children, if you want to create a diamond, okay, so diamond means uh, it should tilt a bit, right? So we will, we can use turn after this point in direction. We can add here turn 45 degree and uh, let's see what it will create now. See, we can see a diamond shape now. See, in this way it is creating a diamond shape. Okay, so this is how we can use. Now children, if you want that it will create a diamond shape but it will create, it will change color very frequently. So what we can do here, here. You can see more steps, 100 steps uh, we have given here, okay. So, we will put one more uh, uh, repeat block here. Choose repeat, 10 and inside this also we will put 10 and change pen color put inside this repeat block. Now, this repeat 10 times. What it will repeat 10 times? It will first Move 10 steps, it will change color and then it will turn 90 degree. Again, it will repeat, move 10 steps and change pan color 10 times and then only it will turn 90 degree. See? See? In this way. So, whenever we want to create a colorful uh, design, what we need to do? We need to put repeat block and inside the repeat, we, should, we can put move and change color. So, this is how we can create a diamond children. Okay, now let it be her. Let me remove this thing. 45 degree. Okay, so we can create different different shapes here, children. So let's see here. I want to repeat the same thing six times, but with the angle 45 degree. Now see what it will create. Let's start. Can you see children? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It is creating something but in a colorful way. Okay. So let me increase the number of steps here. Let's say 8. See. Now it is creating octagon. Okay. I will erase everything and see. It is creating an octagon in the same way if you want to create an hexagon you can decrease the number of steps here or you can change the turn degree turn 30 degree you can use so try these things children change the number in this degree okay you know angles and degree you learned everything in the mathematics so uh, degree you can change and see the change what will happen here if you will change the degree every time so we know children in our square shape, we can see 90 degree of angle. So, we can put turn 90 degree. In hexagon, uh, in, uh, here in octagon, you can see 45 degree of angles. In hexagon, you can try with 30 degree of angle. In the same way, if you want to create a triangle. So, in triangle children, uh, to create a triangle, we need to use different types of degrees. Okay. Uh, let's say here. Let me choose from the motion block, turn block first. First it will uh, point in 90 and then uh, let me choose turn 60 degree and after 60 degree it will move for 50 steps. After, wait a minute, after moving 50 steps, steps what I want, I want it to change its direction because what I want, I want that it will move here and then it will move this side. So, either you can uh, use turn, turn in degree, otherwise you can also use point in direction. I am using point in direction, minus 90 this time. See, minus 90. Okay, minus 90, again use move steps. And after that you can use again turn because what, what I want here 
it will come from here to here then it will turn left side it will move left side and then again it will go this direction so again i want to change here let's say 120 degree and the same move 50 steps i want to put here 50 steps let's see let me erase everything okay erase all and see see this time it is creating a triangle can we increase the number of steps here so children number of steps will also matter here okay so uh, if you want a bigger line then you need to change the number of steps but let me use this see like this okay so every time whenever you want to create a bigger line or so you can increase the number of steps and if you want to create the thicker line so you can change everything in the set pen size okay so this is how we can create shapes children so so many shapes we have created here see octagon we have done we have created circle also we have created square triangle diamond also we have created so in this way we can create shape first you need to set the direction okay every time first set the direction of your sprite after setting the direction children what you need to do after setting up the direction you need to uh, you need to uh, do the changes in your uh, sprites movement okay means uh, how much you want to turn it and uh, for which direction you want to move it so everything you need to set one by one okay let me put these things here and see it's all it is changing color every time okay so this is how we can use these things let me increase the number here remove this from here and put it here change pen color after its movement only okay now again i am changing it to 20 now see it is creating a colorful triangle now okay so this is how we can create different different designs children okay see so these are the de designs that we have learned today. So whenever you want to draw something, whenever you want to create any shape, any design on the stage area, you just need to set the direction, put move and change color in the repeat block and you are good to go. Okay. So this is how we can create shape children. If you want to watch more videos related to scratch or any other uh, topics you can check in the description box uh, each and every playlist link is uh, already i have put there okay so i hope you like this video if you really like this video please like it share it and subscribe my channel thank you so much